Hello there, Bartaski V here, and welcome back to another episode of Bartaski Plays Minecraft. So, in this episode I thought we would start it off, and for the most part finish it off. It's going to be a pretty short video I figured to start the week, but just wanted to show this off. This is a nice compact chicken farm. It is not my design. It is by uh, Zoomavoid. So go check out his channel. I'll leave it. Um, a link to the video in the comments. There we go. I couldn't find the words there. So yeah, please uh, check him out. He does a lot of stuff like this and more. So yeah, let's talk about this now. Um, so here we have a chest, of course, for your stuff, which you connect to a hopper. So the chickens will be here, some of them anyway. So they'll be babies. And then when they grow to adults, the lava here will trigger. And, um, so you have your, I, I should explain a little better. This is dispensing the eggs, so that's how you get your chickens here. This carries the eggs from, <clears throat> let me climb around, up to here. So you'll want to build stuff around here to keep the chickens from escaping. And then this comparator here, along with, where is it? So you put a torch on this block. So this block is right behind the comparator. Then you put this block here. Put your torch on the lower block. Next to this block, you put your redstone, just redstone dust. Then you put one here, and below you put your torch. See, that's off because of this being powered. Then you have this here where you need another redstone piece, and that'll that'll do it. So now. I thought we would build the actual containment area, I suppose. Might be a good thing to call it. So if you don't want the redstone showing, you have to do a little more to cover it than I am here. But I figure it doesn't really matter that much, since I mean, really all of these are pretty raw. In design and you can very easily see the redstone and see what's going on so it's not a big deal to me at least for this build so let's build another three blocks here and here and I'm gonna keep going so a few things to keep in mind with this build is that when you when you build it, you don't really want it to be outside in empty air like this because rain can put out the lava from the chickens or that's burning the chickens. So I suggest doing something like maybe this. You could do that like over the whole top or something. And ultimately it's probably the best uh, best idea. So how about I get some eggs and some chickens and some lava and then I'll be right back and we will try it out and see how it works. Okay, so we're back. So as you can see, it took a little, well, you can't see it, but it took a little time to get this uh, these chickens to show up. Because our chickens had to lay eggs and stuff like that. But here they are. And I... Oops. I did, um... Let's see. I did see one. No? I know it worked once and one of them got killed. See, the way it works, as I explained before, is when they're adults, then they're taller, so they register with the higher block. And then it lavas them and uh, free chicken dinner.
At least that's the idea, so let's see if it works. Come on, little guys, come on. You know you want to grow big and strong and make me food. Yeah, you know you want to. Hmm. They don't seem particularly convinced, do they? Well, that's okay. Hmm. Hopefully they change their minds in the near future, however. Okay. Well, since we do have to wait for them to grow up, it could be a little while. So, let's actually collect some wood and expand this chest because, for the most part, once we start getting the grown-up chickens in and out, it's going to be really efficient. So we'll want to make sure that we are capable of holding all of the eggs. And, I mean not the eggs, the chicken and the feathers. So if you don't have a skeleton farm, this is a great way to get feathers, which you'll need to make arrows. Since we do have a skeleton farm, we don't really need to worry about uh, the individual components to making arrows, since we can just, um, just go get more whenever we need to. I'm gonna have to change the way all this works in a little bit. Okay, I did, nope. Okay. Let's do it this way. Okay, come on. Grow up. Come on. <laughs> hmm. They really don't seem like they want to grow up. It's, it's kind of annoying. I don't have any seeds really to give them right now. I mean, I could go back and get some, but... I fear is that if we go back again, then they'll have all grown up and we'll miss it and they'll all be dead. And we won't even get to see if it works. Well, I guess we would. I mean, if there aren't any chickens, we would know it didn't work. But still, I would like to see a little, uh, a little burning going on here. Well, at the very least... Something we can do. Do I have any blocks on me? Okay. So, this is open here. You don't have to. I just I left mine open for now. If we throw some eggs down, a chicken will likely hatch. Come on. I'm kind of hoping to trigger the... Hmm, I'm trying to trigger it without necessarily having them grow up by having them fall. That didn't work. Okay, well, never mind. I mean, that didn't work, so we'll do it now. So, okay, well, there are more chickens in there now. So, come on. Grow up. Start growing. Needs to be a little more growing in there. We're not done yet. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, well, while we are waiting on that, I suppose I can also show. So these are the other chickens. Uh, so you see, they're not all adults yet either, but when they are, they'll start regularly laying eggs, which will go through into the other area where, provided they ever grow up, we will get fresh meat. Oh, this was dumb of me. I didn't really even look at this, did I? Okay, there we go. Yeah. So now that opens. Still nothing in there. Well, 
Well, I hate to end this off without having actually seen it go all the way through once. I mean, we could be waiting a while to really get much of a result, so. I guess I'll end it off here, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, maybe you learned something. Certainly hope so. Uh, remember, check out Zoomavoid's channel. I'll leave the link in the description. So I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.